Hey guys, what's up? I want to show you a program called WinLocker, which is a unique way to unlock and lock your system using USB devices, and this is really quite cool. So if you're like me, who you always have your USB device on you, that means people can't actually get into your system without that USB device. So it's kind of like a key to your system, and it's a really nice way. It's a nice way of thinking about it. So let's go into the program, and the second you go into it, it'll ask you to enter a new password. So I'm going to enter a new password, which is going to be meow for this video, and instantly it shows you a few settings. So as you see right here it comes up USB unlock yours will say install to USB mine's really installed I've done it before or you can just do a standard password unlock um, and it will tell you each time uh, which one's been used or not so I'm gonna go to reinstall USB which for yours would say install USB once you click OK you need to find your USB device to make sure obviously you have plugged it in first of all which mine is here once you click OK you have to wait and it will say that it has been installed to your device you have to then wait um, it just tells you a couple of things like if you do actually have a password or not you can use it to unlock so once you click OK again it can be used it's as simple as that if you then decide OK I do actually want to use a password instead of using my USB that's fine but I kind of consider the USB device as a key to a, to a door but instead it's a USB to a machine so it's pretty cool and then you have some other settings such as only allow USB unlock or only allow password unlock um, now I'm going to use both and I've also added active full screen. It won't actually do full screen if you don't have full screen, of course. And you can do a lock shortcut too, which means you have to keep doing this every single time. So if you create a little shortcut, as you can see, that's now there. And as soon as I double click that, instantly the lock will happen rather than me having to keep going through all that and settings all the time, which is neat. So let's go to lock windows. Now, instantly, as you can see, I don't have any control over my machine. I can't actually use my mouse. My mouse is dead. I can't touch it. It says status locked, failed unlocks zero, shutdown attempts zero, um, locked since 334, and it then just says password unlock. Now the only way I can type is in that box, I have no other way of moving this around. Now I was thinking about this. So if you just simply rebooted your machine, all that would happen is you'd come back up and you'd hit the normal screen desktop again. However, this isn't really for that. It's mainly the deterrent to stop people from ringing, oh I can't use their machine. If you're in the middle of a piece of work and you don't want people messing around with it, it's also a good way to do that. And plus, you do have your standard Windows password as well that you can set up to stop people from just rebooting willy-nilly. And I don't remember the last time I said willy-nilly. Anyway, so password unlock. Once you put the password in, which I believe mine was meow, it will come up WinRAR. It, WinRAR? Keep doing that. WinLock R is unlocked. However, I've only put the password in. If you want to use your USB to do this, and I'm actually going to use the shortcut we've just created, and bam, uh, all you have to do is use your USB device, which mine is in my hands, and you plug it in. You hear the little ding ding. It'll come up, found USB, unlocking, and done. It's instantly unlocked. Now, if we actually go on to the files of the USB, as you can see, nothing new has actually been installed. There is nothing. It's all privately done. It just basically makes the USB into a key. So it's pretty simple, pretty neat, and it's really effective. So if you did like these videos, please do comment, rate, and subscribe, and the link is in the description.